Good morning, Legends, and welcome back to our first Wednesday back since the break. I'm sure all you folks missed our Wednesday OHS TV team as much as we've missed you. We have a ton of great announcements for you today, coming in with a total of 18 announcements. I think that's a new record. Your directors for today are myself and Lakshmi Petty. Your producers are Mandy Zhao and Amar Nazarelli. Your studio engineers are Zunara Syed and Chantal Shoga. And your writer for today was Leo Andruko, and your coordinator was Vinzi Yao. And as always, a big thank you to Leon Osmar Parent Association for all their help with LHS TV. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy today's announcements. Good morning, Legends. Sorry for the late start. We had some technical difficulties. I'm Carrie Liu. And I'm Adele Liao. And these are your announcements for this Wednesday, February 7th, 2024. First off, from the Record Club. Are you a music lover who wants to share their music takes or just find some new artists? If so, the Record Club is having its first meeting today in room 117. So be sure to stop by and join the Google Classroom for more updates and announcements. And a reminder from our bylaw officer, you need a student parking placard to park in our south parking lot. To receive a parking placard, please head to School Zone to fill out the form at the bottom of the school news section. Now, what do you have for us from athletics? Andrew? Thanks, Kerry. I have two athletics announcements for you legends, so I'll get right to it. First off, for any male and female players interested in playing rugby this spring, it's time to give rugby a try. Join us Thursday at lunch in the library for a quick info meeting. No matter your experience, level, or background, there's a place for you on our team, and we welcome players of all abilities. And secondly, from athletics, congrats to both junior basketball teams on important wins last night. The men came away with a 12-point win over Jasper Place, while the women hung on to defeat Beaumont by three. Tonight sees both senior teams head out to Shore Park to play ABJ. From career and technology studies, Nate is holding their next in-trade events next Thursday. There you'll get the chance to meet with Nate graduates, staff, and industry members who will share their journeys and experiences in the skilled trades. Events will happen during the day, so be sure to have your parents excuse you from class during the event. Head to lhs.ca slash Nate to find out more information and register for the next In Trades event. That's it from me. Over to you, Eric. Thanks, Andrew. I've got a bunch of exciting news coming up for you legends starting tomorrow till the end of next week. From the Trivia Club, there will be a bubble tea fundraiser tomorrow at lunch in the Grand Staircase. Drinks are only $8 and all proceeds will be going towards supporting the club. From Losa, they're holding their very first movie night, also next Tuesday, in the Mac Lab Theater. We'll be watching Three Idiots and the movie starts at 5 p.m. Tickets are $7, which includes snacks, and can be bought from today until Friday in the Grand Staircase. And just to make sure next Tuesday is extra fun and busy, the SSC invites you to participate in a workshop hosted by the Today Center on Tuesday, February 13th, after school in the library. There will be activities surrounding teen violence, dating awareness month, and you could win some candy for participating. Now over to Angela for some more announcements. Thanks, Eric. From Mr. Robertson and the Muslim Students Association. We would like to invite everyone to Jeopardy every Thursday at lunch in the fitness room. Come join us for some fun trivia and an enjoyable time with friends. Snacks will be provided and we hope to see you there. From the Senior Pal Club. Looking to spread some love this Valentine's Day? Senior Pal invites you to join our Valentine's Day card drive. Craft handmade cards and letters to bring happiness to seniors living in care homes. Join the Google Classroom to view the guidelines for writing letters and more information. Drop off your creations in the box located in the front office by February 12th. From LOHS Regeneration Club. Hey legends, have you heard? The GHG Gardening and Regen Yeg Clubs at Lillian are merging into one. LOHS Regeneration will be having their first general meeting tomorrow in room 244 at lunch. If you would like to help lend a helping hand to transform Lillian into an eco school. All members of each club are invited and new members are welcome to join in. And now for everyone's favorite daily quiz week segment. Quiz with segment over to you, Choyen. 
Thanks, Angela. What's up, legends? We're back at it again with our Chinese New Year themed quiz quizzes. I hope you're all as excited as I am for this next question. Hurry and pull out your phone and scan that QR code so you don't miss out on getting a chance to win not only a legendary prize for yourself, but to also help your Block One class be one step closer to winning that pizza party. Okay, now to our program. Our winners. From yesterday's quiz was, was Brayden K in grade 10, and our teacher winner was Miss Amendolia. And don't worry, legends, we didn't forget about today's firecracking Chinese New Year fun fact. From Mrs. Wang and Miss Yin, did you know firecrackers have different uses depending on when it's set off? People stay up on Chinese New Year's Eve and set off firecrackers at midnight to scare off monsters and bad luck. In the morning on New Year's Day, firecrackers are used again to welcome the new year and good luck. Join us in the Grand Staircase at lunch today for some new Lunar New Year activities and a loud and exciting lion dance performance to shoo away monsters and bad luck. Now to the question we go. Which of these foods re represent wealth during Chinese New Year? Is it A. Dumplings, B. Fish, C. Apples, or D. Tangerines? Make sure to submit your answers ASAP before the end of Block 1. Carrie, Adele, do you have a favorite Chinese New Year food? Mine would probably be dumplings, and also from the SFTC. The SFTC encourages you, all of you to participate in the SFTC's February Menstrual Awareness Drive in partnership with the Elizabeth Fry Society by donating menstrual and hygiene projects, products to help, those support, to help support those in need. A full list of accepted items can be found on the donation boxes in the library where you can put your donated items. We are accepting donations for the entire month of February, and we are looking forward to your contributions. And a reminder from the BSA, the Black Students Association Club is hosting a door decorating contest for Black 2 classes during Black History Month. So be sure to decorate your doors throughout the month of February, and the winner will be announced by the end of the month on the 28th. Keep up with LOHS TV in case of new announcements posted by the BSA. Happy Black History Month! And that's it for today's announcements. Check the description down below for any codes or links from today's broadcast. Don't forget to check SchoolZone for more info and follow us on Instagram and X at LOHS underscore legends. Remember to like, subscribe, and smash that bell icon. And be sure to check out the Student Solidarity Committee's Instagram post to see their research on current events. Click on hashtag LOHS underscore SSC to stay up to date. And for LOHS TV, Andrew L, Eric S, Angela B, and Choyun H, I'm Carrie Liu. And I'm Adele Liao. And just remember, be legendary. legendary.